Okay, we're gonna do a little update here. As you can see, I've got uh, the 1915 together. I bought some new tins. Um, I think this is the first time in my life I've bought new aftermarket tins. And uh, I highly recommend you don't. <laughs> Get the original ones if you can. These need a lot of trimming and a lot of work uh, to make it uh, fit properly some gaps and whatever anyway you know how it is um, these are fine I, I haven't really found any trouble with the uh, fan shrouds and this is what I really needed because I didn't have one with a doghouse so I bought that and I figured uh, for the money let me just buy these and they'll work I'll, I'll, I'll eventually get them to work uh, but at any rate yeah so it's looking good got uh, the trans out I'm going to um, work my wiring and uh, redo the wiring because I, I wasn't happy with the way it was before so I picked up this old transmission and uh, you better look at it it does have a uh, 388 gear in it so just uh, a friend of mine had it it's been around our circle for a while and uh, it came up for sale, and um, I decided it would fit nice in the, the 63. After I did some modifications, of course, I don't know if you can see it, but uh, I had to um, open up the uh, torsion tube there a little bit and open up the uh, package tray. But I'll fill all that in, that in. I'll make a box, and I'll get some metal and just weld over that. So... It's getting there. Um, I'm going to try to bring you along as I can. I'm trying to get as much done as I can. It's my off day. So, at any rate, I got a nice cool shifter that went with this uh, trans guy included. It was pretty nice. So, um, at any rate, this should do the job, I'm hoping. Got to get my brakes on. Uh, like I say, I'm going to rewire all this mess. This is a total mess here. And I want to make it make it look a little better. But at any rate, I'll check back with in with you in a little bit. And let you know how, uh, how much I've gotten done. It's hard to see. But it's in. Thing hooked up. Good. I know it's sorry it's dark. I uh, see that now it's dark. Anyway, so got my fuel line, got my uh, throttle cable tube thing here, I got the clutch tube all in, um, got the mid mount all in there looking good. I got the K for bar all hooked up. I gotta put uh, axle boots on. And I need to get my uh, brakes back on. So I still got a little bit of work to do. But the torsion where I had to notch it for the trans is all in. Uh, well, I'm sorry, welded up. So that's all good to go now. Next will be the motor. And I already talked about that. So it's just a short update. I don't have much to say. I just, you know, it's a lot of boring stuff putting the trans in. So at any rate, y'all have a good one. And looks like I'll be starting on the motor. Actually, I'm gonna, I'm, I'm gonna finish up the brakes. And I'll do a little video on that, I guess. And um, again, not much to it. Just gotta bolt in, bolt on spring plates and look at the brakes, I don't know. Whatever. Y'all have seen it before, so I will uh holler at you later.